What's going on, Dragon Ball Z fans? It's me, Batman Loves MC, or Kyle. And today, I'm going to be doing a Dragon Ball GT rant. Now, I tried doing this before, but YouTube removed it due to copyright reasons. This this happens to me every now and then. YouTube removes stuff, takes it down. Um, so, anyways, I guess I'll just have to do it all over again. But, the reasons why I hate GT. And... First of all, let me just get this straight. Let me just settle something. No one likes GT at all. Really, it did hor Most Dragon Ball Z fans hate it. And I can see why. And I'm going to be telling you why. Honestly, I'd rather watch Dragon Ball Z Kai all day than GT at all. First of all, the opening sucks. It's just... It sucks. It's like some... You know, it's rap or whatever. It's just... It's weird. It sucks. Second of all... Um... They're all, no, none of the Z Warriors are in their prime. Everyone's an old man, like Krillin. Krillin dies again, he's like 60. Master Roshi somehow still alive, I guess because he drank from a fountain of youth or whatever. I don't even know what the deal is with that. But he, he's weird looking, he has like these sunglasses, and he looks like a rock star, I don't even know. And then Gohan is like a little, a little bitch with his glasses. He made him a, they made him a nerd, I guess. Don't ask why they did that, I have no clue. Trunks, Trunks is, um, I really don't have anything to say about Trunks, he's just lame in that, and GT, I'm not even gonna get into him, because it's just pathetic, Bulma is an old woman, and she's gross looking, Vegeta, and in the beginning of it, he's an old man, he has like a mustache, and then later on, he's somehow young, first, and then that's another thing, the villains suck, Baby Vegeta, Lord Lude, the Black Star Dragon Ball Saga sucks, um, half the GT, like, I haven't I've even seen, I don't even think I've ever seen, like, the, the, um, last, the last saga of it with Omega Shenron, I'm pretty sure I've never seen it, I might, I might be wrong, but I just can't watch it, it's, it's horrible, Piccolo, they, Piccolo dies, that makes no sense to me, I have no idea what the deal is with Piccolo in the end, I'm not sure if he's even, if he's in hell or what the deal is with that, I don't, I don't, I don't understand that part. Um, see, the only, the only good Dragon Ball, the only villain in GT is Super 17, I thought he was pretty cool, um, it was a stupid idea, if you think about it, I don't know how there were two seven, uh, two Android 17s, damn, my voice is cracked, I'm not sure how there were two Android 17s to begin with, but there were, um, so I guess, I, I guess that was a good idea, whatever, I guess it was, he was, he was badass, I'm not gonna lie. And then, like I said, he's really it. That's that's the only good Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball GT villain. That's that's it. Just Super Seventeen. Lord Lude sucks. Um, Cardinal Moochie Moochie. They, they come up with the dumbest names. I don't even get that. Um, Pan. It. I could probably watch GT. Maybe if it wasn't for Pan. Pan ruins it for me. I'm sure a lot of people would agree with me when I say that. Pan is just. Grandpa, Grandpa, she's always she's so annoying. Most annoying character in the Dragon in Dragon Ball Z and GT, all of it. Just the most annoying character ever. Such a little oh my god, I can't stand it. And even at the end of Dragon Ball Z, like when she's at the World Martial Arts Tournament, she's even annoying then, but not as annoying. Just just ridiculous. That little robot thing, Giru, whenever it is, he annoys the hell out of me. Giru, Giru, all he does is say his name, really. So, Dragon Ball GT has nothing going for it, at least for me. And, um, <clears throat> well, don't, I, we don't really have to worry about GT anymore because no one, everyone hated it. And I think that's really why they did Battle of Gods. I think that had a little bit to do with it, like I said before. But, um, I support it. Like, if it's on TV, which has happened to me before, if it's on TV, I might record it and watch it later. But I doubt it. You never know. Uh, so, what are your thoughts on Dragon Ball GT? Which one do you like better, Kai or GT? They're both god-awful, but I'm going to have to go with Kai. So, leave a comment down below. Because I'd love to know your all, uh, your, all of your opinions on it. And um, Batman loves them. See you guys later.